up guys today we have Samsung A10s tear down this assembly the screen is smashed so we are going to replace it in the next video remove the sim card slot here we are just going to show you the full tear down this assembly we can just remove the back frame the back housing by just swipe swipe the edges there is no heating for the back glass or the back plastic unplug fingerprint flex cable start removing the top screws Remove the plastic piece covering the cameras. Remove the rear two rear camera. They are different from each other and they are not combined together. Remove the shield protecting the screen flex cable and the battery flex cable and unplug the battery. Unplug screen flex cable and then unplug the flex cable connecting the main board to the charging board. Remove the front camera. Remove antenna It's the board looks like Remove ear speaker Now start removing the bottom screws This plastic shield contains the loudspeaker, the ringer and under it we have the charging board Easy while remove it, don't push so much otherwise you will break it always handle with this with caution there's adhesive under it that's why it's somehow difficult to remove it you can heat it before remove it it's out now Remove now the vibrator The charging board always contains the charging board, the microphone The audio jack and always Antenna connecting From the charging board to the main board We have flex cable Connected to the loudspeaker as you can see The flex cable goes under the charging board and then 
connected to the right to the loudspeaker now I will show you how as you can see those pins connected to the one as you can see and from the charging board these two pins connected there let's take it out heat before remove it it's better otherwise you will damage the wires inside the flex cable we always prefer to show you the best ways to remove all the pieces so you can do the job perfectly We have here the volumes and the power button connecting under the main board. We are just have two little things I forget to remove it's the battery and the LCD. I will show you in few seconds. I just wanted to show you all the pieces that I have removed. Let's start digging. Okay, I'm kidding. It's better for you to remove the battery because the screen flex cable is under it. If you remove the screen now, you won't be able to remove the flex cable. You are going to cut it. So if your screen is working, you need to remove the battery first. Okay. Mine is the screen is damaged and smashed as you can see and need to, to be replaced in the next video. Hit the screen, you can hit the screen at 230 Celsius degree for every 30 second and as you need. Push the screen and then put plastic piece under it and then you can remove it easily. Dealing with glass is very serious, sometimes you need to wear gloves, it's better for your hands and remember to put glasses in your eyes, maybe some glass will fly to your eyes, so protect both your hands and your eyes. Removing the screen was very easy, the adhesive isn't very hard, I don't know why. As you can see the flex cable goes under the battery, so I had to cut it.
bring the knife and cut it okay remember to remove all the small pieces of the glass and the adhesive from the frame because any tiny piece of glass could easily break the new LCD you are going to put make sure all the frame is very clean before putting the new LCD it happens to me once I had to buy new screen to the customer from my pocket because it's my responsibility we need the ear speaker shield protecting the ear speaker from the old LCD remember to take it out so we are going to put it to the new board and then to the new LCD now hit the back to remove the last piece it's the battery remember dealing with battery is very 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 dangerous you can't curve or hole or damage the battery while you are removing it because it could be explode while you are removing it so you are you must handle with it with caution if you felt the battery is is going to heat while you are removing it it's better for you to throw the device on the ground and and go and survive your life yeah you need to go away from the battery because it will explode and some fire will go on you that was for today if you like this video don't forget to support me with subscribe and like we'll see in the next video see ya like subscribe enable the ring Click subscribe in the circle. For any questions, write it below.